So you might be trying to figure out how you can scan documents on your Samsung Galaxy S23. Now, luckily for us, it's a very basic process, but we can do this all within the stock camera application. So what we want to do is we want to go ahead and essentially bring over a some document that you want to go and get. So in this case, we'll use the top of this phone box. It's been working pretty well the last few days, so I'm going to try it again. Hopefully it works this time. And what you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your camera application. Now, when you do that, what's going to happen is you can go ahead and then try to, you know, pretty much take a picture of this specific top portion of this box, but don't actually take the picture. Now, when you see that, if you actually see right in the bottom right, right here, there's a little scan button that pops up. That is exactly what you want to click on. So what you want to do is you want to go and click scan and it'll go ahead and automatically take the photo for us. Now, when we do that, you'll basically come into this panel. Now, if you don't see that scan button, you may have to step back a little bit on your specific phone. You may have to go down that direction. That's usually what that means. And then when you come here, all you're going to have to do is go ahead and click save. Or before you go too crazy, you can go and click, you know, retake. You can extract text. There's a lot of other things you can do here. You can also kind of, you know, kind of change this one down. If you want to, you can change it from this corner right here to another corner. We're just going to keep this like it is for now. And then you can go and click save. Now, it's going to save the scan over to your specific you know, uh, files application, or you can open it up from here as well. Now what you can do here is you can go ahead and basically edit up the scan by clicking edit, and you can basically add a filter to it, which is what I would recommend doing. So you can click this little filter here, and you can do a grayscale on it, which is more common with a lot more, like basically a lot more you know, uh, scans of some sort. So you can try finding like that grayscale option, which is at the very end, and you can change how much of a grayscale it is, but that's typically what I do. If I'm scanning anything on my Samsung Galaxy, I'll go ahead and take that scan. I'll go ahead and basically, you know, take it like this, and that is it. Now, you can save it if you want to as a different thing or whatever, but that's pretty much how you do it here. And from here, you can go ahead and share the scan out if you want to. You can share it out to whoever else you want to, and that's pretty much how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.